Uh, good morning, my community. Uh, today, uh, we're gonna keep doing what I start uh, last week. Uh, is to talk about the community, to close the gap between both community. We African uh, people live over here. What's going on? Uh, today, I'm gonna talk with my my one of my friend, my good friend, Laura Oliver and see what she think about us and what relationship she got with African people and I hope you guys gonna enjoy that <laughs> Good morning, Good morning, my followers. Uh, today I'm with Laura, Laura Oliver, and like I like I said, uh, most of my video on my channel is in French, and I try to uh, close this gap because people tend to them ask me why you don't do your video in French, uh, in English, then you can get what you're saying. And at the same time, sometimes it's like when two people, two community come together, sometimes miscommunication brings problem, and I'm gonna try to close this gap too on my channel now and talk about how you guys live over here and how we live where we come from and something if you can close that gap if you can close this gap I think we can have better relationship together and that's my that's my intention for starting this do this kind of video now and I think my people will like to know who you are I am Laura Oliver yeah and can, can we know more about you? Like, uh, what are you doing for a living? Where you live? Stuff like that? Oh, well, I do for a living. I'm a certified CNA. I live at 40 Amy Drive, East Africa, Connecticut. I have three children, five grandkids, and one great grandkid. Wow, you got full house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and uh, I know sometimes I can ask some questions, maybe. If you are uncomfortable to give an answer, but it's fine. But uh, do you have a lot of African friends? No. Why? You don't like African people or what? No, I love all kinds of people. And why you don't have any African friends? Oh, I've never met any African friends. I only have you as an African friend. Wow. <laughs> that, that means I'm blessed. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But... Uh, the reason, like in your job, you don't have, or you don't have those kind of relationship is just a work, work rela relationship or outside the work, your job, why you don't? You no. know, I know you guys sometimes have to have fun with people and no African friends. What do you mean with my client? No, no, I'm saying like in your job, you got co-workers and that mean in your job, you have no co-worker who's from Africa? No, the kind of job I do, you basically on your own. You ride around. You, you you don't see that many people. I don't get it. No, I, I go place to place, house to house. Okay. When I used to work at the nursing home, it's different. You see people. I don't see people. You basically are like on your own. Okay. And the only people you see is the your clients. Okay. Okay. I mean, because you don't have African food, I can ask you if you like African food or so so and so because you don't have African food. I'll try all kind of food. I tried some African food before. Okay. Indian food. Okay, African I think food. it was it was goat. I think it was goat. Goat, goat and, and and what's that? My pongo? My pongo? What's that? It's like it's like a dough thing. It's like but it's like this big dough thing. You eat it with your hands. Oh fufu? Fufu, yeah, fufu. Okay, fufu. fufu. I yeah, know fufu. fufu. Yeah. Oh, they made that with uh uh yams. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Back home. You 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 boil yams and you you pour that. But over here we got flour. You got like yam flour mm -hmm. and you mix with hot water mm -hmm. to make that. Oh okay. Yeah, and uh, I I don't I don't wanna say it's a typical uh, uh, West Coast food, but I know we love that. I'm from Togo, by the way. I'm from Togo, mm -hmm. and we love that. And I know Ghana people eat that too. Uh, Benin, Nigeria. I think the most of the time, uh, West Coast people they love that kind of food. Okay. I don't know because you know it's something you need to 
get to. Africa is not a country, it's a continent. Mm -hmm. uh, every country have his, the way they do the thing. Everything is different. Uh, sometimes people think Africa is country. Are you from Africa? I'm not from Africa. I'm from the continent of Africa, but I'm from this country. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. That's something sometimes you need to talk about to make people know where, where we came from and where it is. Oh, uh, that means uh, I'm so uh, I won't say disappointed, but I don't know. You don't have African friend. That's okay. But do, do you have American friends? Yeah, I have you. I got <laughs> I got some some other people too. Oh, okay. Yeah, but the thing is, you know, sometimes uh, everything the problem sometimes is the media. For me, the big problem is the media because. Mm -hmm. What we hear about, uh, what you get here about Africa, make you maybe sometimes uh, don't wanna come too close to African people because most of the time, what people hear about Africa is disease, is war, stuff like that. And at the same time, what we hear about, I'm gonna say, black American Negative. people is ghetto, drug. You see what I mean? Yeah. That because of that. Because all those uh, things the media pull out, mm -hmm. that make that 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 make uh, we have this distance because we are afraid from you guys. For you guys, you are afraid from us. But when you try to know each other, we're gonna close this gap. Yeah. This is media. This is media. That's what they put out. Like in in Africa, some people don't don't even know. They got ghetto in, in, over here. They think everything is beautiful because that's the that's what they show us on TV. And you know, TV, the big job of TV is watch brain. The TV watch people brain. Yeah. That's what the TV do. That's why you guys to get together. I mean, you, that's why it takes like you to get to know somebody American and see it for yourself. That, that's, I'm saying, yeah. And I can see it. I mean, knowing you, I see how you are for myself. Instead of like hearing it, like African people are, you know. Yeah, that 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 that's the. I'm gonna say that's the. Uh, why I'm trying to do this now because mm -hmm. we hear so many things about you, and you can hear so many things about us, and most of them are not true. Mm -hmm. Don't get me wrong; they got bad people in both sides. Both sides, yeah, of course. They got they got bad people in both sides. Like usually, but they got very very good people in both sides too. Mm -hmm. But they don't show uh, the uh, the good side to people. They just show the bad the bad side of people, and that make people have that opinion. Who is wrong? Who is wrong? That that's the problem. Mm -hmm. And we need we need to come together as community. To make sure we can close this gap, because this is the, I, I'm gonna say this, sometimes this is the uh, the source of problem between community. Sometimes, like right now, so the thing will happen between cops and uh, civilian right now in mm -hmm. this country because we don't have communication, and even between black people and white people because we don't have communication. Black people try to live on their side, with doing their thing. The white people, but. If you try to know each other, everything can go more easily for everybody as a nation. Right. That's why I think. But like like I say, trying to be open to black people, to mm -hmm. African people, we gonna see that African people are good, uh, friendly, and I'm gonna say sometimes the problem. I won't say the problem is because most of African people who live here, they got they got a lot of responsibility. They got big. It's why sometimes uh, young young people who or kids who are born over here, they don't see the the life the way people mm -hmm. grown up in Africa before they, they got here. Because when you grown up in Africa before you got here, you got a lot of responsibility. Because you, you see, you live here, but you still have family back home. You have to take care of sometimes. That makes something harder on us. Listen to this. There's a guy down the street. Can't even look at the place. Nice place to wear a house. Yeah. Sit down the basement. 
and an African person came. He says to her, oh, I'm not written it right now. I'm not written it right now. I'm not going to go. I'm not written right now. But he ran to the African people. Why? He didn't run to Ghana? I didn't look, but she wasn't just looking. She was saying yeah. to him, oh, this is a nice, very nice place. He was showing it. He showed it. Then when the African people came, he goes, oh, I'm not written this right now. But he showed it to him. That the house is, uh, is belong to African people. Yes, belongs to the African people. Yeah. Yeah. You see? Maybe he's scared too. Huh? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Because the communication. And you see what I mean? Because they got some idea about people. Uh, sometimes it's hard to get it, but it's why we need to, we need more people like you and I mm -hmm. to talk to our people. And we need kind of this kind of uh, 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 YouTube channel to show people this this is not always true. Right. This is not always true. We need to let, uh, let break that wall between us. We need to break that wall. Why well, you break that wall? By communication. Patient. Okay. By talking to each other. Okay. By by showing another image of people. I won't lie to you. When I got here, I was scared about uh, uh, Black American people too. Because what we hear on TV, mm -hmm. what we see in the movie, killing people, killing each other. That's the only thing we know about, about that. That's what that, that that that's the problem. You see what I mean? But killing's everywhere. I know. Mm. But it's everywhere. But the thing is, most of the movie we saw the bad people are black people. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. The black the black community are the people go more, most of the time in jail. The people do drugs. You see what I mean? Yeah. That's what that's the only thing we saw on TV. By seeing only that, you make your mind. See what I mean? Mm -hmm. By seeing only that, you make your mind about those people. Oh, those people are dangerous. I don't want to come too close to them. But that's the only thing we know about them. Oh. Yeah? Be because of what? Because when of media. Me, were, you, were you scared? Yeah. No. The first time you're gonna be you're gonna you're gonna be careful because you don't know who she is and you don't know how this relationship is gonna end up. Mm -hmm. You see what I mean? That all those because of what you hear on TV, what you hear on the news, because the media. You see what I mean? And and this one, this thing, we we as people, we as friends, we as uh, coming, how to make sure we close that. Mm -hmm. If we don't do that, that's gonna be always like that. Yeah. We need to talk to our kid, we need to talk to our friend, and to close that gap. Because, like I said, when you watch most of the movies we used to watch in Africa, from from here, or even here, most of the time, the bad, the bad people are black people, or Spanish people. Most of the time, white people, are the the good, the white people are the good ones, most of the time. I, 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 don't, I don't say it's not, it's not, sometimes we got, uh, 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 Good white people, uh, good uh, black people too. But most of the time, when you saw the movie, the the bad one are black or Spanish. Yeah. Most of the time, <laughs> and you know sometimes by watching those movies that make the wash brain, that wash your brain, and if that wash your brain, you keep that as your reality. That's the problem, and we need to talk more yeah. and more yeah. and more. Because the community. Yeah. Yeah. That's what you need to do. Mm -hmm. I'm happy you. I'm glad you. You are my first person to start this uh, kind of uh, thing in my channel. And I'm glad you like to do that with me. And I hope I'm going to have more people from your community, mm -hmm. more people from my community. And we can talk together and to close this gap. Thank you. And have Thank you day. too. Can I have a hug? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Bye-bye.